Hey everybody and welcome back to Coffee with the Moms. It's Nicole and today I'm going to be showing you um, just a little um, ornament that I made for the kids for the daycare, a couple of the kids. And it's pretty simple, pretty easy and fairly inexpensive. But before I got into that, I just wanted to tell you guys there's some new laws with the government and YouTube and we'll be having some changes on our channel. Um, I'm going to make a whole video on that for you guys. But I just wanted to let you guys know that um, going forward, I'll probably try and get it up on Friday if I can. Okay, so getting back to the video. So I have some paint brushes, some acrylic paint I got at Five Below and the, the foam balls I got at the Dollar Tree. I had that little cup, the tech glue I got at the Dollar Tree and just some like little Dixie cups that helped with the paint and stuff. But it's really not, this is fairly inexpensive and I am not that good at painting or stuff like that. So just to forewarn you, if I can do it, you probably can do it because I am not that great at it. But I did want to show you, I had already had the balls filled when I decided, the ornaments, I'm sorry, filled before I had decided to make a video on it. So honestly, all I did was I took the foam balls and I poured them into the little cup that I see there and I folded the cup and then I just kind of slowly dumped it into each individual ornament ball. You just take the tops right off of there. Um, be very careful with these balls. If you go, they go everywhere. So I just, you know, I made sure I was sitting at the table and I just did it slowly. That's probably, you know, the most um, tedious thing that you will have to do because if you do drop them, it makes a mess and they go everywhere. And if you breathe on them, they decide to go all over the place. I'm just telling you from experience because that is exactly what happened to me. All right, so now let's get into the rest of the video. Okay, so like I said before, I took the little foam balls and I opened it up and then I, you know, folded the cup over and put them in there. And I just, I I only made four of these um, for the, the younger kids. So it was very easy, very simple. Probably took me about five, ten minutes to do each one. That is including me making the mess and cleaning it up. Yes, I made a mess and cleaned it up. So again, everything is from pretty much the Dollar Tree. All right, then you're going to get your googly eyes and your tacky glue, and you're going to glue them. You're going to glue those eyeballs on. I would use extra glue just because they are, the ornaments are rounded and the googly eyes are not, so you need a good amount of glue. Then what I did was, I took black and orange of the acrylic paints that I had and I put them in the little Dixie cups. I just needed a tiny bit. This is even more than what I ended up using. So then what I did was I just, I made a little um, triangle sideways for the carrot nose. And also guys, I want to tell you what I did to make the little stands to have them dry on. I took a paper, I took a toilet paper roll and I cut it up. Very easy. I already had one free if you have toilet paper in your house, which I hope you do. Then after that, what I did was I took the end of one of the paint brushes and I just dunked it into the black and just dotted on each smile. Um, and you will, if you want them nice and even, you want to have, you're going to have to go in like a couple times, even just doing the amount of dots that I did. Um, and you don't want to swirl around your paintbrush too much or they'll become too big unless you have a bigger ornament and that is what you want to do. Um, so that's pretty much all it is for the front. Very simple, very easy. And then I just had to let, sit and let them dry. And that was probably the longest part of this whole thing was letting each one, each ornament dry afterwards. So I did the front and then I ended up doing some stuff on the back too, which I will show you. Okay, so here is it all dried and all done. And I think they came out fairly good. Like I said before, I am not the best artist when it comes to painting, but I did try. And I think that the younger kids will really like these. I think they'll appreciate them um, a lot. And then I just wanted to show you the back. I did end up putting all the kids' names on the back. Um, I'm just covering up because I don't think they want you to know their children's name. And I just put the year um, 19 on there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope maybe this quick little video will just give you an idea for last minute gifts. Cheap, easy, so quick to make. You can do it in a couple hours um, counting the paint drying. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Um, and please don't forget to hit that bell notification so you're notified anytime Lisa or I decide to post a video. And keep a lookout for the video coming on Friday. Um, that'll explain some more stuff about the changes in our channel. Bye, guys.